breaking news from SpaceX that's redefining the pace of space exploration, the sixth Starship test flight is launching in just 10 days, the fastest turnaround in the program's history. This announcement comes hot on the heels of Flight 5's historic achievement, where we witness the mechanical arms of the launch tower execute the first ever catch of a returning super heavy booster, a feat that many thought impossible just months ago. The FAA and SpaceX have officially confirmed November 18th as the target date, marking a dramatic shift in launch operations. Not only is this the shortest gap between Starship flights, but for the first time, we'll see a twilight launch that promises spectacular views of the vehicle's descent and landing in broad daylight over the Indian Ocean. This is Elon Musk 24 hours, your front row seat to the future of space technology. In today's video, we're breaking down everything about this groundbreaking launch, from the enhanced booster catch mechanisms to the critical engine relight tests that could finally pave the way for orbital operations. Let's dive right in. What makes this sixth flight truly extraordinary is the unprecedented speed of preparation. SpaceX has completely revolutionized their turnaround process, transforming what once took months into a matter of days. This rapid advancement isn't just about setting records, it's about proving that frequent, reliable space launches are finally becoming a reality. The engineering teams have worked around the clock, implementing lessons learned from previous flights while maintaining rigorous safety standards. The shift to a twilight launch window starting at 5 p.m. Eastern Time is a strategic masterpiece. This timing ensures optimal visibility for what could be the most spectacular Starship landing attempt yet. The sun's position will illuminate the descent path over the Indian Ocean, providing unprecedented views of the spacecraft's controlled landing maneuvers, a sight that space enthusiasts worldwide have been eagerly awaiting. The lighting conditions will also enable better video documentation, crucial for analyzing the vehicle's performance during critical phases of flight. Behind the scenes, SpaceX engineers have been working tirelessly to implement crucial upgrades. The Super Heavy Booster now features enhanced redundancy in its propulsion system, a direct response to insights gained from Flight 5. During the previous launch, SpaceX CEO Elon Musk revealed a fascinating detail. The team nearly aborted the booster catch due to a misconfigured Raptor engine parameter. This close call led to comprehensive improvements in both hardware and software systems. The Raptor engines themselves have undergone subtle but significant refinements, improving their reliability and performance under the extreme conditions of launch and landing. The mechanical catch system, affectionately known as chopsticks, has undergone significant refinements. The launch tower's massive arms have been fine-tuned based on data from the successful catch during Flight 5. Engineers have implemented new abort criteria and commit parameters, ensuring even greater precision in this intricate aerial ballet between the tower and the returning booster. The control systems have been enhanced with additional sensors and improved algorithms, allowing for more precise adjustments during the critical moments of capture. One of the most ambitious additions to Flight 6 is the planned in-flight engine relight test. This crucial capability has never been successfully demonstrated on previous Starship flights, and it's absolutely essential for future orbital operations. The test will occur during the upper stages journey, pushing the boundaries of what's possible with rocket reusability. SpaceX has developed new ignition sequences and fuel management systems specifically for this test incorporating lessons learned from their extensive experience with Falcon 9 relight operations. The thermal protection system has also received substantial attention. SpaceX is taking a bold approach by intentionally removing sections of heat shield tiles from specific areas of the spacecraft. This might seem counterintuitive, but it's a calculated move to gather vital data about thermal dynamics during re-entry. These insights will prove invaluable for developing future catch mechanisms for the upper stage. The engineering team has installed additional temperature sensors and monitoring equipment to capture detailed data during this crucial phase of flight. Safety remains paramount in this accelerated timeline. The flight path has been meticulously planned with multiple contingencies. If automated health checks detect any anomalies, or if the flight director doesn't issue the final manual command, the booster will automatically divert to a controlled splashdown in the Gulf of Mexico. SpaceX has upgraded the fuel drainage systems, significantly reducing the time needed 
to secure the booster after a successful catch. New safety protocols have been implemented at the launch site, including enhanced weather monitoring systems and improved communication channels between different operational teams. The implications of this rapid launch cadence extend far beyond just technical achievements. SpaceX is laying the groundwork for a revolutionary space transportation system. The ability to launch, land, and relaunch within days is crucial for establishing an orbital refueling network, a key component for future Moon and Mars missions. This capability could also enable the deployment of next-generation Starlink satellites designed specifically for Starship's massive payload bay, potentially bringing direct-to-mobile internet services to millions. The economic implications are staggering, with potential cost reductions that could democratize access to space. Looking ahead to 2024, this sixth flight will influence the design of Starship Vive 2, which is already in development. The newer version incorporates lessons learned from these test flights, featuring redesigned forward fins for better aerodynamic performance and enlarged fuel tanks for extended range. These improvements aren't just incremental changes. They're transformative upgrades that push the boundaries of spacecraft design. The V2 design also includes revolutionary new materials and manufacturing techniques that could further reduce production time and costs. The space industry is watching this launch closely as it represents more than just another test flight. It's a demonstration of SpaceX's ability to rapidly iterate and improve while maintaining rigorous safety standards. The success of Flight 6 could accelerate the timeline for commercial space operations, from satellite deployments to eventual human missions beyond Earth orbit. Other space companies are already beginning to adapt their own development processes in response to SpaceX's revolutionary approach. The most remarkable aspect of this mission is how it bridges current capabilities with future ambitions. While engineers focus on immediate objectives like catching the booster and testing engine relights, each success brings us closer to regular orbital flights and eventual Mars missions. The data gathered from these tests will be invaluable for developing the robust systems needed for deep space exploration. SpaceX's testing program is effectively creating a new blueprint for spacecraft development and operation. The innovations being tested on Flight 6 aren't just about pushing technological boundaries, they're about making space more accessible. By demonstrating rapid reusability and efficient operations, SpaceX is paving the way for reduced launch costs and increased flight opportunities. This could open up new possibilities for scientific research, commercial activities, and space exploration that were previously constrained by traditional rocket systems. The potential applications range from orbital manufacturing to space tourism and even interplanetary cargo missions. The environmental impact of rapid reusability cannot be understated. Traditional rocket launches typically result in discarded stages and significant waste. SpaceX's approach to full reusability could dramatically reduce the space industry's environmental footprint. By recovering and reusing both stages of Starship, the company is setting new standards for sustainable space operations. This aspect of the program has attracted attention from environmental scientists and sustainability experts who see it as a model for future space development. The success of Flight 6 could mark a turning point in human spaceflight history. With each launch, SpaceX is not just testing a rocket. They're validating an entirely new approach to space exploration. The rapid turnaround capabilities being demonstrated could fundamentally change how we think about access to space. From scientific missions to commercial operations, the ability to launch frequently and reliably could unlock possibilities that were once confined to science fiction. As we watch this next launch, we're witnessing the birth of a new era in space transportation. As we count down to this historic launch on November 18th, we're witnessing more than just another test flight. We're seeing the future of space travel unfold before our eyes. SpaceX's achievement in reducing launch turnaround to just 10 days marks a pivotal moment in aerospace history. This unprecedented pace combined with groundbreaking innovations in booster recovery and engine relight technology brings us one step closer to making space travel as routine as air travel. I'll be covering the launch live on this channel, bringing you exclusive insights and analysis as the events unfold. If you're as excited about this revolutionary moment in space history as we are, hit that subscribe button and join the Elon Musk 24-hour community. Don't forget to ring that notification bell to stay updated on all the latest developments.
Share your thoughts about these incredible developments in the comments below. What aspect of Flight 6 excites you the most? Drop a like if you're ready to witness history in the making and share this video with fellow space enthusiasts who need to know about this groundbreaking mission. Thank you for joining me on this journey through the cutting edge of space technology. See you at the launch.